Tell you how much I love this new stuff. New, I, stuff. I, I, new stuff. This 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 whole new YouTube thing. I Why? can actually see. I can actually see what everyone else is seeing at the moment. They're just seeing the end of the of the trailer. The mini fit, the blow of smoke, and, and now flame. our logo's coming up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they're about to, <coughs> about to come to us live now. Um, oh, so we're at, so we're actually like um, you know, about fifteen seconds in the future. Yeah. This is just just oh, wow. I've got I've got, I've got to share this with you. I've got to share this with you. I'm going to unclip my. You could hang on a minute. You're gonna you're gonna share. So hang on. This whole new screen with graphs and chat, and I can see what everyone's. Oh, oh I like it. Wow, that is, is a bit on the fancy side. I've got oh, a new screen. Yeah. If you think it's impressive, stick five pound in the super chat. Um... <laughs> <laughs> and good evening, welcome to Vent Talk UK episode. Oh, it's on. It's on my screen in front of me. One eight nine. I'm blagging it. We're not blagging the show. There is actually a reason it's called blagging it. Like, well, we're not blagging the show any more than usual. We are. Yeah, we are. <laughs> this is bugging me because I'm 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 fixated on what I've got on my screen, and you can't focus on what you're actually supposed to be doing. I can't. No. 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 You just you're just I'm wanting not... to. Like, how many viewers have we got? What are they looking no, at? I'm are not, are, I'm are, they, are in... they making a cup? Does it even tell you if they if they've buggered off to make a cup of tea? That Maybe. that was just weird as well because I looked at you on the screen and you were talking, Chandler. Yeah. And now you're laughing. Now you're laughing whilst oh. It's... Hang on, I need to see what we really there. need to do is we need to test the super chat feature, and it's got it's probably got a number that's zero dot zero zero. So if anyone goes and sticks a tenner in the super chat, then we'll see it pop up, and we can test all the features. Oh, super chat. Anyway, good know. evening. We all well. So this is what the uh, super chat money's gone on then so far. So the donations we've had so far has just upgraded YouTube uh, very slightly. Yeah, even though that was a free upgrade. Oh. Yeah, yeah, it's not something we've done. So, uh, so basically, the, the money that goes in Super Chat, are we going to put it all in a pot and then uh, have a nice Christmas do uh, or something? We That's might have enough little... for a beer apiece by the time uh, it comes to Christmas. If you I'll want to you buy us a 2019 Christmas drink, <laughs> stick £5 in the Super Chat. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Super Chat. <sighs> Welcome to Black Dimmit. Talk UK. Right. Yeah. So yes, I'm fine. Thanks, Mark. Uh, thanks ever so much for asking, Mark. How are you? I'm I'm all right. I've had um, I've had a bit of an uppy downy week, to be honest. But um, we'll talk more about the ups when when it's happened. Um, I did did want to bring something up. Joe you know, was moaning like fuck last week about my headphones. Yeah. I don't know if I complained live or not. But um, on the on the bottom of these headphones, I, I'm just going to take them off a second, just to show you. Where is it? You now can't hear so us. There's a, Mark's there's a, a little dick. button. See that? There's a light on it there, and yeah. Yeah. I, you press it, and that is what I assume to be the only button that you pressed and hold to to sync everything up and to reset and everything else. So, yeah, happy with that. And then, for some reason, it all got disconnected and I could not connect it. It was been a right bitch last week. Mm. Anyway, everyone's saying, press the B button, hold the B button down, hold the B button down, and hold it down for four seconds and it'll blink. So, holding the button down, 
blink for four seconds, nothing. Anyway, it turns out there's another the B button. button is actually a button on the side. Incredible. I was pressing the wrong. Evening, Ronnie. Evening, Ronnie. That was, um, that was a roller coaster. Yeah. Also, I, I, I've taken a lightning to um, scary videos at the moment. Uh, I've been watching quite a lot. Stop checking your time. I wasn't. We're, I got a, a notification from Ronnie. Oh. Hi. Um, oh, no. No, oh, we haven't. Yes. So no. I've been watching these. Um, been watching these. Um, these videos on on YouTube. And I'd like to shout the channel out. Actually, I can't remember for the life of me what it's called. <coughs> uh, top fives. Yes. yes. Unbelievable. Me and my other half have been watching him for like two years. I've just started, and I've spent. I'm probably spending three to four hours a night just sat watching. But He's some got a of mesmerizing them, voice. Yeah, right. <laughs> Who did I say he sounded like? Who is this? Who? What? Nukes top fives. Right. Nukes have you ever five. listened? Have you ever listened to Ready Player One? Yeah. No. He sounds just like Wade's voice in Ready Player One. Go back and listen. It is his voice. It is his <laughs> voice. Because you think he's American? He's actually. I think he's Dutch or Norwegian. I think he's Norwegian. No idea. Um, but his voice. Is just spot oh, on. Yeah. But either way, I have scared the shit out of myself this week so bad. But that, it, this channel, it's not all about sort of rah, scarers and shit like that. They're like just proper creepy. And I Hang on there, a minute. Hang on a minute. All... Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Hang on. Wade, Wade in um, Ready Player One. Uh, you, yeah. You're talking about the audio book, aren't you? Yes, yes, yeah. we are. Yeah. That was narrated by Will Wheaton. Yeah, Will Wheaton, yeah. Use his own voice for every character. Can you imagine how boring that book would be? Does he? So Does he not? Is it? Is it? Shops. I like Does going it... to the shop, said Wade. I also like going to the shop, said Wade's mum. I also like going to the shop, said Karen. He's got different voices for different people, Chad. No fucking hell. Um, but he does okay. some really good videos on like creepy abandoned buildings, or it will be like children that have seen ghosts or it'll be like the black eyed children or just go to his channel it's honestly it's crazy but not right now honestly the the hairs on my arms and i'm convinced yeah. now that the house is haunted because the tv's keep turning on and off i'm your computer kept flashing up last night apparently my computer kept flashing up last night ah what are you vaping on mark me i'm vaping on berserker one arm coil 12 milligram old flower and apple um i have also where is it i slid it in between my legs there she is um i'm also using the 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 berserker starter kit hmm? how is it uh it's all right it's all right for a coiled a coiled device it's nice and tight you know me i like nice. a nice type i like a nice tight pull um Yeah, oh. and in that, in that, oh, that got me. <gasps> and in that, Crim Sold Assaults, Ooh. Um, from Jeff Arras, Vintage Vapio. Oh, very nice. What, you vaping on Chandler? Me? Mm. I've got, I've been mouth to lung in it all week. It's absolutely crazy. Uh, I hear I you know. had a bit of an accident. Uh, who told you that? You did on yeah. one post that you posted on VVRP. <clears throat> yeah, that's true. Uh, yeah, on the on the podcast, uh, I mentioned I had a slight incident. Uh, not that one. That one. Uh, I got uh, I got a vicious ant um, with to go with my saver, and yeah, had a slight incident. I tried to set it up so I it would work with my Tafon GT. Which hasn't hasn't got a particularly sticky outy pin. In fact, it doesn't it doesn't protrude at all. So uh -oh. I tried I tried tightening up the five ten. Put the uh, uh, put the tape on on the top, and there was a bit of a gap. And I thought oh, bollocks, there's a gap. Never mind. Uh, fired it just to see if it worked. 
it hard shorted the battery. Uh, and I think I fused the uh, basically fused the 510 because I, I can I can I undo it? Can I bollocks? I've had pliers on it. I've had all sorts. So have you just um, admitted to um, using a uh, an RTA that didn't have a protruding 510 and going bollocks to it? I'll use it anyway. No, because it's not hybrid. It's not hybrid mod. Why does that matter? If it if it's a, if it's a hybrid mod, yes, don't you don't want to use. You need a protruding 510. But it's not a hybrid. It's got a it's got a 510 pin in it, so it shouldn't have made any difference whatsoever. Um, it's just because I'm a complete numpty and can't remember how manual 510 adjustments work. <laughs> so basically, this photo was taken. Uh, if you if you look really closely, uh, you can see that the tank doesn't quite align up with the atty because there is no 510 on the top. I'm, I'm moving my mouse like you can see my mouse. Uh, yeah, there's no actual 510 connector on there because I've fucked it up and wouldn't be able to get there and can't get the atty off. What did that set you back? So, fortunately, the, you know, the retail price of the uh, Vicious Ant, 13, 18, 13350 mm -hmm. 139 Fortunately, £139. Yeah, fortunately, I paid 35 quid for it. But still, that's that's thirty five quid. But you know, thirty five quid's thirty five quid. But yeah. Oh. so yeah, so I would have been vaping that had I not fucked it up. Oh, so oh. In, instead, instead, I've got that. Are you above just holding it up to the camera nowadays? Yeah, oh, there, there yeah, is. I am. <laughs> there it is. Let's see. Fairness. So and I made my I made my saver all nice and shiny because it was a black saver. I haven't got a stainless one, so I made it all nice and shiny specifically to go on my vicious ant, and fucked it up because the reason I put the tafe on on the vicious ant in the first place was because this was in bits because I was polishing it up. So yeah. I never actually got it polished up to so go on. Had the then. No, no, I'm not. I'm not a happy bunny. Mm. So. So there you go. But I've actually found out this armor box is actually quite cool. <laughs> I know it's about twelve years old, but unregulated gives you a gives you a little five LED display of what batteries left for you, and the saver fits in it quite nicely. It's quite a stealthy little thing. It's not. Too I'm, I'm quite enjoying it anyway. So that's pretty much what I've been using, and and I have got on standby um, my Smokia with the Serpent SMM, and I've got uh, Lemon Tart in there from Dark Star because I found it at the bottom of the cupboard. But I think I filled that tank up uh, about three days ago, so that's how much I'm using it. At least your Smokia still works, eh? I uh, well, I give me a chance. I haven't dropped it yet. <laughs> well, I've, I've got a spare one if you need any. Any any spare parts? Any spare parts? Can anyone can anyone yeah. think of software that you could use to share your screen as a webcam output? I don't Xsplit. Xsplit. Um. Right. <laughs> is that is that because mine says Xsplit in the corner of the screen? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Virtual. Um. Shall I do me? Shall I go? Shall I have a... Yeah, sorry, Kaz, what are you vaping on, mate? I have dug out my H Cigar VT75. Um, mm. I've got my Berserker on it. Nice big 26650 battery in there. So, loads and loads of battery life. And this is a 0.3 coil, actually. But it's only, it's only like six... Seven wraps of 26 gauge stainless. Um, so, I'm surprised it's come out so low, but it's quite nice. Mm. And I have got... Wick Liquors Boulevard Shattered Salt in there, um, which is fucking awesome. Uh, Boulevard Boulevard Shat Salt. Shattered. Oh, it's shattered. Their men, it's their icy version of Boulevard, um, and they've done it okay. as a salt. So I've got that. And in the Zel2, um, I've got Got Salt's Crumbacco, which is a nice little biscuit tobacco fake. And this one's been going I, quite well. I, I've run out of tobacco. I've I've I actually meant to put an, put an order in with. Oops, sorry, you're still full screen. Um, 
I meant to put an order in with Just Dad Nick um, for mm. the past three days, but I've completely forgotten. So I'm just really I'm, impressed I'm, by this one. Um, because it's just quite a dark tobacco with just a hint of biscuit, but it's been really clean on the cores. I've got a bottle and a half through this pod, and it's still going strong. Um, so quite impressed by that, really. You see, I got that one, one and that one and them two from from Just Add Nick, and they're quite dark tobaccos, and I'm really not a fan. So if you want, I could. I'll sling those over to you. Yeah, both yeah. twelve milligram. I'm always up for trying a new t tobacco, especially something that's a bit higher, Nick. Yeah, they're both twelve milligrams, so I'll send those over for you. I'm not. Lovely, thank you. Not enjoyed them as much as I was hoping, just because I think it is quite a dark tobacco. I like them quite light. Yeah, I mean, some dark tobaccos. I've been like, yeah, this is fucking awesome for like two days. I'm like, nope, nope, it's too much now. Job done. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mark, I've still got some of that strawberry rhubarb tobacco. Have you? Hmm? Yeah. Well, you need to get some of that over to me. Oh. Strawberry rhubarb tobacco. It's incredible. It sounds so wrong, but... And yet... Wasn't, wasn't it incredibly expensive? It was, yeah. But it's so good. Simon, I've run out of Foo's Gold. I'm devastated because I love that stuff. And I know he was showing quite low numbers on the website when I went to order the other day, so I'm just praying and hoping he's not run out. I, I'm still I'm still looking for the napkin ring. I'm, I'm waiting for the napkin ring. I haven't missed he it, have post, I? He posted the tracking details today, so I'm guessing they'll be with him in the next couple of days. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's all right, then. Because I, you can guarantee I'm going to miss it. Probably. Chris, anything like your there? reply time. What have you <laughs> got the strawberry mixed up at? Uh, three milligram. <sighs> Sorry. Three? <laughs> three? Is X is X split, is X split free? Yeah, I haven't used it for ages. That's why I've still got some. Oh, uh, okay. What the? It's a free trial. X split. Yeah, I, uh, yeah. Well, no, I'm. I don't pay for it. It's, no, it is free. I am. Uh, you pay for you pay for the extra features. You pay you pay for the fact that it doesn't actually say X split just down here. Mine's promise, telling me to buy a fucking to license. There must be a there must be a continuing. To be to be honest, mate, um, the, this this computer when it arrived had got X split already installed on it. Oh yeah. <laughs> 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 Chris, can if you, you num if you number each of the screenshots, is that is that possible? Uh, not really. I can send you them one at a time in order if you like. And then can you not just screen share the Facebook chat with it in? Well, you can, but Mark's being a pain in the arsehole. If you go to the chat, Mark, click the settings wheel, click open in Messenger, click yeah. the first image and make it full screen, and you can just click through them. This is leading up to an incredible feature that we've been planning all week for everyone. Mm. Uh, it wasn't really planned, it was kind of spontaneous, yeah. Um, it's Andrew, it's from, a guy, it? it's from a guy it's in Sunday Canada morning. that makes it a very small batch. Yeah, it was just a, a random event. I like the fact, because I was, because uh, this kind of unfolded while I was working, and uh, each break I came out, I got about 150 messages uh, yeah. between you three to actually I mean, read through. If anyone wants a hint of what's going on, because we've accidentally shot ourselves in the foot, we can't say what it is, but if you know what we were doing over the last couple of weeks, go to Instagram, and you'll see that suddenly we have quite a lot of followers. Don't, we'll get to that. Fuck off. You tell people shit. Ruin the one part... one. <laughs> the one time I bring decent content and Kaz is fucking ruining it. Kaz is nicking it. Nothing. What? Chris, Chris, so yes. so the order that they're in our chat is the order to play them back? Yeah, I think so. I've, I've got some dodgy, ill-fitting image chat, on the in, screen. In the VTUK chat. Uh, right, Chris, what are you vaping on? Uh, I am vaping on... He's got a billet box, surely. Orion, no. Billet box is still in the cupboard. This what? is Orion, yeah. Still vaping Orion. 
It's got in this, it's got sour cherry cola in salts from juice stores. It tastes like arse at the minute, but I haven't set up a new pod yet, so I'm just kind of stuck with it. I have to keep like releasing the air, but there's a little hack. So if you connect this up to eScribe, download the newest software, it has a thing called, like, not preheat or, I don't know, whatever it is. It's some sort of mad thing where, um, so say your volt, your wattage is set to 5 or whatever, it will rock it into 10 to get preheat it, ready to use it at 5, to save there being a ramp up time. Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah, preheat. Yeah, it's like preheat. Yeah, pre yeah. So you yeah. turn that off, and your coils last twice as long. Literally oh. just turn it off. This is on the Orion, yeah? With the yeah, yeah. Thing. Just literally turn that preheat thing off, and and your coils last twice as long. Mm. So I don't know, I've had this coil on. So I've changed the colours of this. I don't know if you'll be able to see this. Let me get closer. Oh, so, orange, red, green, like uh, traffic lights. So green is what I was vaping it on before. Orange is twice as powerful. Well, not twice as powerful, but quite a bit more powerful. And uh, red is just don't use that. Um, so I would have been vaping it on the green setting. And coils were lasting me like three days. Now I've been vaping it on the orange setting, which is more powerful. And it's been lasting me seven, eight days. I mean, people have been getting longer out of it. But I'm really picky about the flavor. The second it starts dipping, I just fuck the coil off. So... For me, um, yes, yeah, brilliant. See, I'm hoping to be in possession of one fairly soon. I have what, the, uh, the, the original or the Q? That one. That Fuck exact one. Now, bollocks, I use mine every day. If Mark's sending you that, I'll send you my silver one in carbon and I'll take his little pearly one. <laughs> Uh, he, he still needs to find out whether uh, Lindsay wants it or not. So I give you a good price. <laughs> I've been bugging him all week about it. So it's doing that dickhead thing where it keeps cutting out. So yeah, I've, I've, get, I've got something to fill this wall. Uh, on a playing card company's website that I buy stuff from, they had a half price deal on uncut sheets. So you've got the uncut sheet of a deck of cards and the deck of cards for twelve ninety nine. So I'm going to have. Wow. Yeah. You you're going to wallpaper your wall in uncut sheets of uh, cards. He's gone again. <laughs> and he's frozen. Okay. Wait for Andrew, does anyone? Back. What does anyone else think to what, while he's while he's not there? What does anyone else think to his wallpaper at the back? I'm, I'm trying to figure out what it is. Yeah, is, it, is, it, is it splattered sheets? Oh, it's floral. Oh, okay. I, I, I thought they were like sheep. Did, did you, did you just plural sheep. sheep? I did plural sheeps. Yeah, sheep. Yes. <laughs> I did. did. Sorry. <laughs> sheep. I've got an eight-year-old. I've got an eight-year-old. She does things like that. And, and, and it's cute. So you, you just kind of latch on to it. I think I've oh, got what keeps fucking up on my... Uh... Can you hear me? <laughs> what the fuck can is going on? Can you see you me? Can't. No. No. Oh, fuck no, you've, you've frozen. Which it, it's actually quite cool because we've got a picture of you in quite a cool position. Actually, it's it, you, you, you don't you, you look all right. You don't look like a twat. It's fine. Uh, and, and 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 then we've got and then we've just got your voice coming out of there. It, it, it's like you've suddenly learnt ventriloquial wisdom. Yeah, your western voice is not here. He's left. Just right. Back. I was good. Thanks. Fuck for that. You're going to have to do it, Mark. We can't do the feature without it. I can't do it. I physically cannot do it. Why not? Because my my machine has been absolutely battered by streaming, and I mean battered. And as I'm send it me, I'll through... share it. Does your share send work? To... Does my share? No, we could do it. He could do it on XSplit. Do it on X Split. So if you want, if you want me to send, if you want, I don't me to need share to pictures. send them to. You. They're in the chat, Chandler. So I just, I just nick them out the chat. Go, go to the chat, right? <laughs> For fuck's yeah. sake! This is what the preparation was supposed to have so, been. Right. Do so these, go, in, do these... go in, go in, go into the chat, right? 
Yeah. Click the little set setting symbol and click open in messenger. And then go to the first image from that scenario, open it in full screen, and then share that screen. And then you can ah, click you and it takes you to the next one. Got you. Are you talking about, so you're talking about in... Um, VT UK chat. In Instacrap. Inst Instacrap. Instagram. Yes. No, on the VT UK chat. What are you on about? On the VT... No, no. Well, why are you, no, why are you some... making me open it in... Right, okay. Right, how far all, back do you want to go? All of the Oh, book. Oh, for fuck's sake. It's all right. It's like I got it. I got it. It's fine. I thought it's you fine. spoke Let Klingon. Me... All right. What a rock man. <laughs> Fuck. Right. Now I've worked out what was cutting me out. I think my webcam was in a dodgy <laughs> USB port. So I've changed it over now. So now I need to bring the YouTube chat back up. Fuck my life. <laughs> this is so a the, fir lot. the first one, Chandler, starts. Hello! Yes. Okay, that... sorry. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Where is it? Yeah, there it is. Right. Is that gonna? Is that working? Uh, and then if you click right, it comes up with a 360 photo. You have to go backwards. Mm -hmm. Hang on, hang on. Let's try that again. Add source, screen capture, window capture. Ah, there it is. Bing. No. Close. <laughs> 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 That says messenger. What the fuck? Let's try that one again. Oh, yeah, we'll no, hang make, on a minute. We'll make, I know what we're I making did. baby steps. No, 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 we're no. making baby steps. We're getting there. Oh, it's okay. Do it again. Do it again. I think I know what I did wrong. Screen capture. Window capture. Dink. Messenger. Dink. Right. So if I do this, boop. Is that showing it? It is, but really small. So we're not seeing the image. We're not seeing the image. image? You're, you're sharing our chat. That's probably not. Ah, there we go. And now Hang scroll on. back. Whoa. Is that. Is it what? <sighs> let let me see if I can work out how to do this. It might be less painful. Oh, hang uh, on. No, no, no. I know why it's small. Because. You've got, you got to find uh, the right starting image. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. I just closed the window. That doesn't help, does it? This is just amazing. It's awesome, isn't it? Don't you think we're just we're just, we're just so professional? Meanwhile, uh, is there any vague talk or just geek? No, talk? no, no. Right, 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 right. Oh my word! Right, stop, stop, stop. Chandler, Chandler, Chandler. No, he's good. He's good. <laughs> let, 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 oh. Sorry, I've had less back painful back operations. Right. Oh, every time, if I minimise it, it closes the damn window. What the hell? Right. Mark, have you got any reactions whilst we're doing this? Reactions to what? Stuff, things, mods, kits. No, not at the minute. I agree with you, Stuart. It is like telling your mum how to use a new phone. Hey. Right, screen source. I can still hear you. Mm -hmm. It keeps cutting out. It's stressing me out. This is stressing me out. And everything. There oh, we go. Hang on, no. hang on, hang on. Let me move. Hang on. Have Sorry. you done it? Oh, look at you! Hang on, hang on. We've got all my audio. Hang on. There we go. Right, right. Oh, are, are we doing? Are we? Are we? Hang on, hang on. Play, sir. Are we doing this now? Yes. Yes, but don't put, bring them up as I get to the end of each page. Okay, right. I will flick back on everyone. Right. So, on Friday at eleven forty-five, which I'm presuming it was, was it Saturday? <laughs> no, don't bring it up no, to the Sunday. Sunday page. Oh, it was Sunday. Yeah, it was Sunday. Sunday morning. Oh, on mine, it yeah, says it was... Friday, and then I replied Saturday. So I'm presuming it was Saturday. So I got a message on Friday night, 11.45pm, I was in bed. I said, hello! Exclamation mark. So in the morning I replied, hi. <laughs> Do you want to promote your Instagram and YouTube? Permanently 
USA active followers and audience. So I looked at his profile and I noticed that he had a thousand followers. I said, "Hang oh, on, he's Chris. gone. Stop, he's stop, gone. stop, stop, stop." Fuck. Um, okay. My other Instagram has six thousand plus. What exactly are you going to be able to do that I can't do myself? Yeah, so, sorry Mark, just to cut in there. Um, when I get to the end of this page, wait until I get to the end of the second page before you flick it over. Okay, okay. Okay, so it saves people reading ahead and it's pointless me just reading it out. <laughs> so... He's gone again. He's gone again. <laughs> I'm about to s seriously crack up at this fucking computer. It only ever happens on this as well. Um, we have a huge group of 40 peoples. We share your account. You get 10 to 15 thousand followers and also YouTube subscribers for $10. 100 plus subscriber. Right, okay. Uh, your YouTube has a low subscriber and views. I can provide subscriber and views. Which I thought was a bit fucking cheeky, to be fair. So, yeah, bearing in mind, Chris, this is your YouTube channel, isn't it? Yeah, this is my YouTube channel's Instagram. Which isn't vape related at all, is it? Oh. oh. I'm going to fucking seriously cry in a minute. No, it's not vape related, no. Um, so I put, I'd rather have organic views, and I've just started the channel. It'll pick up. What the fuck's going on here? Oh, man? shit, sorry. Oh, Stop bollocks. I can't even see chat. I can't see chat. Um, <laughs> I said it. Stop, 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 stop. I'm, I'm fucking going to punch this computer in a minute. Are you sure we can't edit this out? Because if we, you know, we get to the end, we just edit these bits where he freezes. So just just, just, just carry on where you left off, Chris. We'll just edit the bits that, where he freezes, and what? it'll just be seamless. You know what? What we could do, we could do an Ideal Home show and record yeah. it, and then yeah. push it out live. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> could do that. Except we're live already, so it's, you know... What the fuck is wrong with this? <laughs> so, did you put 50p in meter before you started? He's gone again. <laughs> that'll, that'll be a no then. <laughs> <laughs> Shall I continue reading? Yeah, you continue reading. Oh. Yeah. Right. Fingers crossed. So, um... But yeah, I'd rather have organic views, it'll pick up. But yeah, my channel I've seen. We share a lot on social sites like Reddit, Imager, Facebook, Twitter, and many more. You can get audience from there. But do you have examples of the sort of posts you do? Yes. And then he sends me this. Mark next image. This is a, a screenshot of two reviews from uh, some sort of sales website that he has. Uh, both five stars, which is great, but two reviews is easy to fake. So I said, he put, last client, last week, client review. So I'm not interested in reviews, pal. I want to get an idea of what some of your posts. Get an idea of what you write. He put, it's like we promote on our profiles and social sites and encourage people to view and subscribe. We do keyword research, which people interest in your video. Then target them and share. Do you want to go to the next one, Mark? Uh, <laughs> we've lost him again. No, we've lost Kaz as well, look. I don't think this is in the right order, Mark. The one you've got. That is not the next image. Oh, no, it is. Yeah, sorry. My bad. Target them. Why? I didn't know that. Okay. Um... I put, yes, I get that, but I can see, oh, can I see some of the posts you've made? Check on this account and... Pro Chris, your audio keeps dropping out. Right, I, I'm, 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 I'm flat out telling you now. If this carries on every week, I'm, I'm quitting the show. I'm genuinely serious. I'm not putting up with this every week. Um, so check on a recent story. Seven, she got twenty, seventy plus subscribers in four days. Two more days to go to complete hundred. So do you want to go to the next one, Mark? 
So, this is a picture of a profile that he's been promoting, which, again, isn't some of his work. This is just the page, and he's just written subscribe at the bottom. Um, can't take him anywhere. This account said testing us. If we got 100 plus or more, she would order more. If you want, we can also get real USA female Instagram follower too. Wink, wink. Um, so, next page, Mark. As you can see here, he I looked at his Instagram promotion and it literally said, Instagram promotion. Uh, <laughs> right, so I'll show you this here. This is the picture that's in that small bit at the top. Instagram promotion. And there's writing there. And I said... This isn't even all visible. <laughs> Send that back to him. He put, check the other one. So I send him a... So you can't see what I'm showing him in those screenshots, right? Because it's cut out. But at the top, it shows you the subscriber count for each profile. Uh, well, there. So like that one's got 2,600. Um, the second po profile I sent to him uh, at the top again is cut out on your screen, but it's like 4,800 or something like that. Um, he put also do YouTube SEO, a help improve video rankings. So you can go to the next page, Mark. Uh, I said combined, I have around 8,000 followers. He put, we have more than a million. And I, I, at this point, I was going to be like, look, can you fuck off, mate? And something <laughs> in my head just went, no, I'm going to ride this out. So I put, you have more than a million? Impressive stats, bro. He put, mm -hmm. we have a group, 40 person. I says, so why do you only have a thousand on this account? Just ask your million to subscribe to you. He's like, 80 plus accounts. You, this is used to get clients. I put, I could technically get a million if I had 500,000 accounts. With two followers each. It's doable. Awesome idea. He's like, you want 2,000 follow plus followers for $10? It'll take three days. I put, mate, I owe you a favour for that. I put, do you want me to help you promote your Instagram and help you break one and a half, K? And he <laughs> did a laughing face. I put, look, with your million follower idea, I at least owe you a favour. Next page, if you want, Mark. But, um, okay. Thanks for the offer. This account doesn't need more followers. And it's a new account. Gradually we'll get. And we do not need. Only clients. Not too many peoples. I, put, I mean, I can post your profile on my account. Tell them what great, great promotional ideas. It says you might get five to seven followers. A day. If I post at 20 minute intervals. You, put, you can get 1k plus. So at the minute he's, he's offered me 100k plus. 10 to 15k, 2k, and now he's offering me a thousand. I put, I've got 8,000 on my accounts. If I wanted to cheat, I'd just change the handle and delete the pictures, then post my stuff on there. I'm okay, bro, but I want to help you. So, how does now, how does nine dollars sound? Even cheaper than your service. <laughs> I put, Do you want 15,000 followers in one week for 50 dollars? <clears throat> Let's try $5. I'll prove to you 1000 in a day. I was like, what the fuck is this guy on about? I put, sounds suspicious. Do you have a business card? But no. <laughs> <laughs> I put, registered address. Company name? Question mark. He put, for trust. I put, well, how would I send you money? And he sent me a link to Fiverr. Next post, Mark. Uh, it's like somebody's like, operating the slides. Well, technically. Yeah. So he sent me the link to the fiver. And I put... So I put, how would I send you money? I put, like, like in the post. And he put, you pay the money. I provide. I provide, then website will give me. Okay. So next next one, Mark. Put, oh, I don't know about this fiver. It, sound, it says £4.70. Even they're misleading. <laughs> I put, go and check. You will see. So, I put, I have an idea. I'm going to make you famous. Use those million followers. Promote your own Fiverr account. Even if 10% start of the following start paying for your service, you know. 10, 100,000 100, sales at a Fiverr reach is half a million quid. 
Next play, next post mark. Uh, balling. And then he put, uh, I do not need follower, I need client. And then we promote and provide. And I've done a, a very cool Post Malone uh, balling gif. Where he's like dancing along with his gold chains. Pretty cool. And I put, promote your services, then get clients. I can promote your fiver. He put, okay, thank you for your time. You don't want service, you're making fun. Mm -hmm. I says, it'll be a good collab. I can be your Beyonce to your Jay-Z. We'll build an empire. I said, I'm not. I said, if, if you have a million followers, then I want in on the ched. And then I did a uh, little uh, make it rain. You're going to uh, skip to the next one, Mark? I wonder why he thinks you're making fun. No idea. So he sent a screenshot, uh, and it was, again, that same fucking feedback, and it showed the hang bird's on, name. Bear, bear, bear this in mind. These are permanent and non-drop. Bear, bear the non-drop in mind. Mm-hmm. So he sent me that same thing again, and then he sent me um, another picture, which was like, a description of what you'd get for $30. His price is uh, rapidly jumping between $50, $5, whatever, you know. Um, and I put a question mark, and he put five. We've lost you, Chris. Uh, he says, you don't... <laughs> Fiverr client review. You don't even know Fiverr. Next page, Mark. And he sent... Oh, oh, that that was the picture that I'd sent him. So go on. Next one. Oh, there we go. So he sends me this picture of this bird. And he put, <laughs> I promoted this account. And it's got 19,000 followers. And I put, Tidy, did you get a number? I'll give you a fiver for that. <laughs> <laughs> and to which he responded, okay, bye. See you later. And I put, question mark. I want her number for promotional purposes. And he, I put, <laughs> so I was looking, I, I then did a bit more digging and I noticed that it says right in the middle there, followed by Farhan Aventador, which is the same name as this guy, but it's not the same name as the profile that messaged me. So I clicked on that and it turns out that's his personal account. So I put, how many followers does your personal account have? I've spent all this time cutting out the name and his name's oh. there. <laughs> well. Oh well. Uh, oh well. Um, <laughs> Evening, <Farhan. laughs> uh, so, so I knew the answer to this question before I asked it, but I said, so how many followers does your personal account have? And he said, I don't want to tell you. I think you have, I think you have trust issues. This is why I proved by which account I promoted and I guess we should stop here. Extremely sorry for disturbing you. Next, next oh, page. Nice of yeah, yeah. Uh, next page. There we go. I put. I mean, I did check. You don't need to tell me. One point five k. I said you seem to plateau around one point five. Do you want me to promote your Instagram for you for four dollars sixty nine? He put. I'm not alone, bruh. We are in group. And I said, so there was a little bit of a gap between that. And I said, sorry to go off topic. I know this is important business. Next page, Matt. Can, can I look at yes, this? Yeah. Can I? Yes. Can I? Yeah, are we you okay? Can. Yeah, you can. Yeah, yeah, we're okay. So I sent him that. And that, this was a screenshot off of that bird's uh, profile. And I put... Oh, no, Badger. Fuck's sake. Look. What's he said? I can't read the comments. <laughs> He's, He's put his Farhan's link. direct Instagram a link in the chat. <laughs> <laughs> so, I sent in this screenshot of this of this picture, and I put, "Looks like a good client. Shame you're not a masseuse, eh?" <laughs> and I put, "I'm sorry. It seems we got off on the wrong foot. Apologies." And at this point, he blocked me, didn't he? Mm. Yeah. Mm. So then, what I did, <laughs> I I went onto his profile. And it was missing. And I was like, fuck. Uh, go to the next one, Mark. I don't know what your next thing is. I don't know if it's going to be his profile. Oh, there we go. So, <laughs> what I did was, I went onto his profile and it was missing. And I was like, fuck. 
and I remembered his name from the screenshots. Mm -hmm. So I searched for him on Fiverr, and it said, "This is the advert we had here. I will do Instagram promotion, organic and professional. Welcome to my service. What will I provide? Increase your account with real followers who are active in social media by following, liking, commenting, increasing your or or increasing, increase your audience, and shining." Shine your account <laughs> i will help you become more famous audience audience will be no more famous potentially full stop but there isn't one audience will be non-drop and permanent what will you be provide me your username how the account should be public what do i not do make any posts break any terms of service Instagram violations whilst using your account. So that was a bit suspicious because it made me think that I actually had to give him your, your, account, your account details. details. Even though he said, I just need a username. I was, so I thought, hmm. He put, no, your order will be completed in time and you can custom order off there too. Order now. So I was I'm in an R in because he'd blocked me already. So I didn't know if there was going to be any further fun. But I thought, if I order it, then he's forced to communicate with me again because I'm a customer now so uh, I looked at it, it says it'll provide you with 2,300 plus permanent audience to profile what's included action plan full-time engagement page slash channel evaluation management duration is three days delivery time five days now for a start I didn't even see any sniff of a full-time engagement uh, action plan or page channel evaluation and didn't get none of that well we did kind of we'll get to that so i sent him a link to a profile <laughs> uh, i bought it go to next next one mark you bought it oh yeah you why paid, is it blank you paid for his services oh there you go so i paid for it it cost me 12 dollars, even though it said eight dollars i don't know what the fuck that's all about again fiverr being misleading um Please. and it, yeah, well, yeah, it said, uh, yeah, but surely you charge fees to the fucking person that's doing it, like eBay. So, expected delivery was uh, fourteen, which was which was four days. Still got two days on that. Oh, lovely. Um, lovely. Yeah, so twelfth today. Um, so, give me your Instagram ID, which you can see there, and it says order created. Oh shit! I'm sending voice messages to him. Um, <laughs> 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 So, next one. So, yeah, I paid for that. And he messaged me on Fiverr. And he put, hi. He put, I put, hi. He put, thank you for your order. I will do my best. I put, no problem. It's your friend from Instagram. He wouldn't let me message you anymore. Uh, so, I just ordered. I think you thought I was making a joke. He put, okay, sir. I will do my best to impress you. And then, two seconds later, I was unblocked. Um... Next one, Mark. So there's there's the order confirmation. So I paid twelve dollars nine pound sixty eight. So it's just proof that I actually paid that. Right, you next want one. To hear the rest of the story. Put nine pound sixty eight in the super so, chat. So there you go. Congratulations. <laughs> Here's what you ordered. Uh, <laughs> right. So we'll get into this. Let's go back one. Right. Uh, oh, there we go. So uh, for this page, after I sent it, and I put, can you guys do comments also likes? followers uh, followers likes and comments he put, okay do our best and satisfy you um where are we he put, anyway i'm sorry for that i said great farhan i look forward to seeing your skills he put okay and then he i don't know what the fuck this is oh it was a uh, right so you guys i didn't screenshot this for you guys but so basically he had an order that he sent me for YouTube promotion and then it was us next in line and he said uh, I will say all of my buddies to do best for you and as soon as possible but thanks he says your promotion will be starting in a few hours oh no I did send it to you yeah. <coughs> your promotion will be starting in a few hours and I'll try to deliver as soon as possible and as much as can you are also old buyer of five up from 2016 that's impressive <laughs> Well, I set my account up in 2016. I bought one thing uh, this year, which was my uh, Instagram logo, my my YouTube channel logo. I paid some guy to design it. So, 
I don't know what's impressive about that. But carry on. But I made the account ages ago. Uh, If it works, we will buy much more. And for my account. But yes, sure. I'm a YouTube expert, an Insta and music promoter. Um, So... Oh, okay. Sorry, if I have an offer for you, I can make your YouTube channel look more professional and good. Cunt. I put a lot of effort into that fucking channel. I haven't got that many subscribers yet, but I've fucking put some serious effort in. Um, by doing perfect SEO and advanced customization. I said, I said, great. Maybe throw in a few subscribers for my channel. You know, just a sample. Uh, you know, with this order. Uh, I put, Will this order get us likes and comments also? Um, but sure, bro. Can I see your pic? Can I see your picture? Can I, can so I, see I thought he meant picture? which picture did he want us to comment to get comments on? I put there's just four in the account. Just pick one. He put no, not that. I mean, I want to see you interested, and I'll add you to my personal account. I, put, I don't have pictures of me in there. He put I think you've be I think you've been me. Whatever the fuck that means. Um, it's like starting with sour and ended with ending with sweet, isn't it? I was like, uh, "What do you mean?" So at first we talk a little harder now. Oh, I'm back. Uh, I put, <laughs> "What do you mean?" Uh, no, I put, I, "I was being serious, not making fun." Think you just worry too much, but yeah, sorry for that. And tips for Instagram. So now this is what I think he means by that that profile analysis and giving you feedback on the profile. Because he put tips for Instagram. When you post, please add hashtags. <laughs> it helps to get audience who's interested. I was like, okay. But as a bike and car guy, I add hashtag cars, hashtag supercars, hashtag bikes, hashtag loud bikes, hashtag fast. Sp- oh, hold up. Ugh. Hashtag with more than one word, but with a space in it, is the equivalent of just having hashtag fast. So I don't know why he's doing that. I put super. Have done this. This is what we get. So this is this. Is, so this clarifies. So so during our chat, do you want to go back to the uh, back to the pictures that we had up before, Mark? You know the odd ones that interjected into this conversation. I can't. Oh, for fuck's sake. Right, well, let me see if I can find it and show you. So, essentially, um, let's have a look here. Yeah, there we go. That's it. Oh, no, no, it was, it was the other ones I was about. So he started off by him following us, just him, then him liking all of our posts. I was like, for fuck, the mark was like, is this his idea of promotion? Like him just <laughs> manually logging in to like 80 plus accounts and just going through and liking everything. So then this post pops up. Best promotion service mentioned you in a comment. Everyone follow this account owned by... Oh, hold up. So we are, we are already at best friend status with this dude, which is pretty fucking good. Then... Uh, I don't know if, if it's going to show. I don't know what your next picture is, Mark. Do you want to click across? There we go. Some rapid amounts of followers started fly, flying in. Now, this was we were very sceptical about this because mm. Instagram bots... And all, oh, ignore that one. Uh, Instagram <laughs> bots... <laughs> so, we're so, we're so used to Instagram bots that will just like and unlike straight away and fucking... I, but Instagram, they kept coming in and I says... Will I get another 1,200 soon? He's, I was like, we've got quite a few, but it keeps going down now. But yes, soon. My friends are sharing. A few are busy. You'll get more tonight. I put awesome. So this is a screenshot of his Instagram chat. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, whoa. Sorry, hang on. What the fuck? <laughs> I don't what know. Fuck? I must have hit something. Carry on. Carry on talking. So, um... He sent me a screenshot of his Instagram group message chat thing in the jiggy majig. So it was essentially a load of like random Instagram names. 
which he's, he's... Oh, there you go. You've got it there. So he's, like, crossed off the names. And he's, like... So one group's called the best freelancer. And then there's another one, which is, like... I'm presuming these are single people's profiles. And he's just crossed their names off. And he's essentially asked them to share this post. He's like, we're going to share on Facebook too. My buddies have a big group. We, I, You know we are in a group. You must pay your order 100 plus for 15 dollars i don't even know where that that doesn't even make sense it doesn't even fit into the conversation check my youtube gig order and and youtube gig and order custom offer i said well i still don't have the 2300 followers on instagram uh i'll have a look once this is completed brother trust me please okay after 2300 you can order subscriber let's see he's put thank you for everything i put thanks you too so then, I'm just going to go on to the other profile so I can explain how that conversation carried on. <laughs> <laughs> so, all of these fucking followers started firing in rapid succession. Uh, I was very, very surprised. Rapid. Yeah, like literally, honestly, it, it was fucking madness. But they just kept firing in and firing in and firing in and firing in. So, uh, let me just double check so he'd parallel to these messages he'd put hello i put hi he put got you i put we're already talking on the other account um and so then jump into a second thing so we had another message pop up uh i don't know have you got screenshots of these mark um i'm just seeing what i can share bear with me oh yeah because there's some that you may or may not no. be able to share so we got a message. Uh, for, I'll, I'll show you the profile. I won't show you the person's <laughs> name. You're a fucking asshole. Don't be sharing that shit. <laughs> asshole. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Uh, no, I've got I've got photos of said person. That was you, creepy. Right. So, so right. we. I'll we get, just show it on the phone. Message. We just get we get some message from this. From this. <laughs> from, from this lady. Sorry, sorry, so, I was reading. I'm not a cigarette. Hey, Smoke. I didn't even see that. I didn't even see that. I'm, not I'm your drug baby. Smoke. You'll beg for me. <laughs> no love, I won't. Um so her profile says fashion and beauty blogger, DM for collaborations. Right, irrelevant. So the message starts hi, a bit like this other dude, I put hi, put up for collaboration. And I put on what? Now, can I just pause here? At this time, this is the account that all four of us have access to. So, <laughs> Cass and Mark saw that I was also trolling this person and decided they would put stuff in. So it made my trolling job extremely difficult because I didn't know what they were writing. So I was having to wait for their message to pop up and pause what I was writing so I didn't say the same thing they were saying or, or anything like that. So she put up for collaboration. I put on what? She put, uh, I would like to promote your vapes. Most of my followers are addicted to hooker. Now, let me just show this. <laughs> right, hooker. Hooker. Uh, wait, that way. That way, that way. Uh, come on, focus, you dick. There we go. Most of my friends are addicted to hooker. Now, notice that that spelling there so i put i had i have a friend dave who's addicted to hookers got him in a right load of trouble with a wife a couple of years back i still i tend to steer clear of that i'm all about oh no and then this was mark or cass one of the two put i'm just about hashtag vape life and chill yeah that and was, that she was put me. she put hookers i put no rub and tug here thank you very much what are you talking about? And then Cass put, clouds bro clouds. Put, okay. <laughs> then she put, okay, have a nice day. I said, you said followers are addicted to hookers. Your followers are addicted to hookers. And then she she put the correct spelling. Just uh, focus, dick wad. Oh. Making, it, making it larger is not going to make it focus my end. <laughs> there we go. Hooker. I said, your followers are addicted to hookers. She put, hooker. I put, question mark, same thing, right? I put, 
No, Cass put same thing, right? As I was typing, is that like prostitutes? <laughs> <laughs> um, and then I presume Cass put, are you a hooker? Spelt H-O-O-K-A-H. She put L-O-L. Um, I said, well, it's either prostitutes. Oh, we hold up. Him. I'm going to keep my finger on F5. Uh, she put, what's vape? I put electronic cigarettes. As I was typing that, Cass put, vape is life, fam. Um, so I was originally... T- I, didn't, I didn't see all these. So I, I put electronic cigarettes and I, and I went to type the second message. Then vape is life, fam, popped up. Like, like have you ever, have ever seen the movie Split? Or he's got like nine personalities. It was fuck. It was just like that, where it was like I'd gone from explaining electronic cigarettes and taking the piss to vape is life, blood. Like oh, I don't know. So I put electronic cigarettes. It was quite real. You and Kaz that were doing it. It was it was like responses from both of you. I put electronic cigarettes to give up smoking, not get a prostitute. She put wait. I'll show you a picture of a hooker. So. Whilst I was looking for a picture of an actual hooker, just there, you'll see Cass's message just above. Whoa, keep it clean, bruv. <laughs> <laughs> which which kind of took away from my, my hooker conversation. So I posted a picture of that hooker and I put, she's called Destiny. Uh, she got Dave divorced. Destiny, the destroyer of worlds. <laughs> so then she sends me this. Pictures of a shisha pipe, and she put, "This is a hookah, buddy." And then, before I even got a chance to write, "Oh, shisha," Cass put, "That's a bong." <laughs> and then I was like, "Oh, for fuck's sake!" <laughs> so she said, "You're you're taking me wrong." I, so I had to then change what I was writing from "Oh, shisha" to "Oh, shisha bong." So that, that it was. Uh, focus. focus. There we go. But that's a bong. But you're taking me wrong. I put, oh, shisha bong. She put, that's hooker. I said, in our country, it's a shisha bong. Yes, some people call it shish. You're from which country? It's up at the UK. She put, oh, oh nice. Yeah. She, she was like, oh, nice. Buddy, I wasn't talking about prostitutes. You took me wrong. I'm not into that. I put, good, I guess. Uh, don't offer hookers in the UK. You'll, you'll attract the wrong crowd. Um, I says, you'll need to talk about bongs if you want to mention this product. <laughs> like expecting her to then start inboxing people saying, can I promote your bongs? <laughs> um, and then Casper, Dave found out the hard way. Uh, I, put, I put, vapes is different. She put, I was talking about vape. Interested in a collaboration then? Tell me. I put... Uh, then Casp must have put, if only Dave, va- Dave vaped instead. <laughs> she put, thanks. <laughs> oh, yeah, I and missed all I, this chat as well. So I, I sent a picture which you can't see because it was like <laughs> one of those ones that disappear after a certain amount of time. Oh, what the fuck so why are you showing me the fact that the, why are you showing us that that that, that, that we I'm can't see it? Attenuation afterwards. And I said, uh, okay. get one of these, bro. And I think it was a picture of a Zomo laser. <laughs> <laughs> and she put, I already oh. have one. I was like, okay. Uh, I was like, lots of clouds and stuff. And then for some reason, Cass decided to go a bit weird and just come out with hookers charge five dollars sucky sucky. Or was that you, Mark? <laughs> That was me. That was me. <laughs> the only <laughs> contribution to this whole experience. Uh, so then I messaged saying, do you want some juices for it? And then Mark put, love you long time. No, it wasn't me. That wasn't me. I was that Cass. Me. All right. And she put, you know what's collaboration? And then for some reason, Cass put the fucking troll face trying to ruin it for us. <laughs> and I put, I put, like I send you juice or something, and and you like post a picture, question mark. She put, yes. Or just posting pictures and getting paid for it. 
I says, but I don't know much about fashion, because he's a fashion blogger. Um, and I spent my budget for the week on my best friend, Farhan. Now, this is where it gets interesting. Uh, so, my next message to her was, he'll get you good followings. <laughs> Cheap, too. Like, just $12. I put two for me and ten for him, <laughs> trying to charge a finder's fee. Uh, I put, he's good. He'll get you lots of collaborations and followers and um, uh, likes or something. So, so this is this is like genuinely how it was said. I was just rapid firing these messages off before Cass could send something else stupid. <laughs> and they put, he'll get me collaborations. I put, he's an expert and best friend. <laughs> You know the Instagram. He knows the Instagram very good. But I want collaborations. Please tell me his username. If I start earning because of him, but yeah, he'll be able to help. He'll get you. He'll get. Uh, want me to get him to follow you? She put. If I start earning because of him, I'll give him fifteen dollars and five to you. At which point, Cass messages us in the group chat and says, "I feel bad." I'm like, "Oh fuck off." So we carried on. <laughs> She put, basically, I don't need followers. I need collaborations. Ask him for his help. I'm from India, which I, I don't know what relevance that was. I put, uh, he'll probably be able to. He's in India also. She put, nice thing. I got, Chris, I got, I got, I got, I got. Pause. Pause. Right. Chris, what's your Can geography I... like? <laughs> well, I thought my geography was relatively good. <laughs> <laughs> and I had I had a friend uh, at school from Bangladesh, right? And I now as an adult, I'm presuming he told people it was in India to save having to explain to people where it was, because I thought Bangladesh was in India, and I I kind of skirted past this in our group chat because Cass said, "Please don't, please tell me you didn't actually think Bangladesh was in India." I have a confession. Uh, like, as Dave Grohl said, I have a confession to make. I, I didn't know. Uh, <laughs> I thought Bangladesh was in India. But anyway, so I put, he'll probably be able to. He's in India also. She put, nice then. And then I thought, do you know what? I'm just going to set these two up. So I said, I'm not sure how big India is, but he may be close to you. Maybe you two could collaborate. Wink, wink. But he's got a nice car and could take you for dinner. She put, I stay in Delhi. So she was well up for it. She's telling me the town. Fucking two seconds away from giving me a dress so Farhan could shoot around there and his uh, hashtag fast car and uh, pick her up. She put, I just want to know how to collaborate, that's all. Not go for dinner and stuff. And I put, okay, well, he'll message you, I think. So then I, I messaged him. And uh, I sent... Um, there we go. I sent a screenshot, and in that screenshot, it says, it, it, "This is my conversation with her." But he's good. He'll get you loads of collaborations and followers, and or likes or something. And her saying he'll get me collaborations, blah 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 blah. So that was what I read out earlier. That's the screenshot I sent him, and I put, "I have some told someone about you, and she looks interested in buying your service." And he put like a heart face emoji, and put, "Oh, thanks, bro." I put. And she's in India, so you might be able to take her on a date. She put, he put, I'm from Bangladesh, full stop. At which point, I still didn't know Bangladesh wasn't in India. <laughs> and I said, is that not in India? I thought it was. <laughs> and then Cass messaged saying, you do realise that Bangladesh isn't in India. And he put, no, it's different. I put, oh. He put, I've got loads of relatives from the UK. I says, um... Well, maybe you can still help her. <laughs> he put, yep. I said, um, so the rest of that. He said, what's her username? He says, I'm from Silahet, Bangladesh. And I don't know where that is. And it was completely irrelevant. I didn't even reply to that. No, I did. I did reply to that. So I sent a picture of her profile. I said, this is her username. And I put, I'll Google it. So after he views her profile, he then drops the bombshell. I have a girlfriend. <laughs> Like, clearly he's looked at her profile and not thought, oh, she's my drug, I'll be addicted. He's thought, uh, fuck no, pretend I've got a bird. Who's gone? Oh. I put, oh, well, let her down gently. Um, I put, tell her you'll help her with her Instagram. And 
that she needs to fuck off and find her own boyfriend. <laughs> and he put, okay, I can see her photo. Send again and her username. And then we sent the username. So then we, uh, so then that was the rest of that. She did message again saying, oh, I didn't get a uh, follow from him or, or something like that. And um, so we sent his username to her. We connected him up. They may be getting married shortly. I don't know. Um, but, so then back to the Instagram. So looking at the Instagram post now, we had about 160-ish followers to start with. Give or take. Now, bearing in mind this is on Saturday. Now, normally ghost accounts and all this shit will follow you and within sort of 24, 48 hours unfollow you. Because they're doing this to so many profiles, they'll, you'll get lost in that huge list of profiles and they'll have loads of profiles they shouldn't or they don't want to follow on their profile so the the follow account has pretty much stayed at two hundred that's pretty much consistent all weekend right yeah into monday changed. now into tuesday for four days, this has stayed at 2,800 followers. So, what I want for you guys, uh, from you guys, sorry, not for you guys, I would like the chat to tell me what feedback to leave his voice service on Fiverr. And I will put whatever I'm told to put. <laughs> now, I need to get my chat back up. But, you've heard the story... You've heard how Farhan went from zero to hero. He, he took a very sexy lady that he, he was a massive... Uh, it was, it was a client of his and took her to great new heights. He promised and boasted about this 2,300 plus followers we'd get. We, we, we sort of thought we'd hit the tip of the iceberg at about 1,000 followers extra. And then we quizzed him up and he said, you'll get more, you'll get more. And he provided. Oh, he yeah. He did provide. But, that's not to say the feedback's going to be great. I need to get this chat out. I'd like to add in here that the last few messages he sent us, um, where he put at 1am like on in the Sunday, morning? Yeah, yeah, hello bro, and then at 2.20am he put 2,400 plus followers, bro, I'm delivering work in Fiverr, please give me good feedback that my service worked, successfully delivered heart emoji. <clears throat> then at 7.41 a.m., uh, you just received project, I got more than expected, hope I made you satisfied. We'll just put, then we put, we will see if they don't all unfollow. Um, and then so on and so forth. And then he's trying to sell us his YouTube thing. Which, which, you, you, ev I, th I think everyone understands that the whole point of this experiment <laughs> is, is to see how we can blag Blag to vape famous. Blag to vape famous. That's the whole point. The whole point of this. We would, we would never pay for likes on anything that mattered. We'd never pay for the followers. We'd never, you know, this was literally just for shits and giggles on on an Instagram Instagram account that doesn't matter. It is a. Well, this this is what was funny because I didn't. Eat, I was just trolling him and I sent these screenshots to these guys, and uh, they were laughing and. They said, where did you find this? They yeah. said, where did you find this? And I said, I didn't find it. I said, this is me. I've just fucking spent all morning doing this. So then Mark was like, do it for this account. Uh, <laughs> so I, I, I decided to take the plunge. Now, if anyone wants to put £9.48 into the Super Chat to, <laughs> to reimburse... <laughs> he's gone. Oh. He's gone. He's again. gone. Oh, Just when dear. he's trying to was, you know, doing, doing his pitch for some cash. Well, this was purely for their entertainment, and it cost me nine pound forty-eight that I didn't really want to waste. But I mean, I just couldn't thirty-four resist. of you watching now. So if you divide nine pound forty-eight by thirty-four, that comes to about sixty p each. Quick maths. So, on uh, my account, manage orders. Here we are. So there we go. So now the options for the smiley face it's sad the sort of straight face smile or big grin can i get some uh, feedback in chat as to what to put for this smiley face i quite this like the line face visible. it reminds me of that it reminds me of that t-shirt that just says have a day on it 
Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know. It's kind of interesting. I'd like to know uh, thoughts on that. Oh, shut up, Chandler. You're 27.5p. <laughs> <laughs> that's how much that's how much nine pound forty eight is divided by thirty four. Tell you what, if you guys keep dumping feedback into the chat, I am going to move on to the news. Because okay. that was a roller coaster of emotion twice this week. Once when it was happening Mark, did... and once when it was coming back being read back. Mark, did you just put your own put nine pounds forty eight into our <laughs> own account? Don't YouTube take a percentage? No. <laughs> Maybe. I don't even have access to this account to withdraw it. So you fuckers, <laughs> you've just put it into your own bank account. <laughs> I think you lot should all chip in two pound fifty, you fuckers. Um, but yeah, so are, are we? Uh, this this feedback doesn't go to him. This goes to Fiverr. So I don't want to. Public. Uh, it's a public it, feedback. No, 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 no. Yeah. Th this top part with the smiley faces is private feedback. This is just for Fiverr. <coughs> Give him a smile. So, so he's got it. He's got, he, he, did, he did what he said he would. So, you so you've got you've got to do something. Yes, bra. Um, you right. smashed. So I'm it. sending that. Right. Well, we we need to we need to do the stars next before we get to that little uh, share your experience. So, seller communication out of five stars. Can we get a vote? Um, it's got to be five stars. It's got to be. You can't be anything else. For, well, you know, yeah. Messages. I mean, he was communicating with us at yeah, 2 in the morning, 4 in the morning. Five stars. Are we all agreed, chat? Yeah. Um, well, we need to wait for chat to have an input. <laughs> Service as described. Now, it's quite hard because we're only four days in. Technically, we've still got two days of the service left to go. And do you know what pisses me off, actually? On the listing... It offers expedited service within 24 hours for uh, an extra four quid. So I nearly paid four quid extra to get it done for, in time for the show, and it was done anyway. So we've got five stars. We've got <laughs> yeah, Orgy we and an Rob Harper. Well, no, we where, didn't get the action plan. Action? No, no action plan, no consultation or anything like that. So so on sell at service as described, are we going for four stars, Stuart Legg says? Are we going to go for okay. four stars? Four stars and a thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs> so we go four stars, service as described. Would we recommend him? Well, we technically did to that other bird. <laughs> I mean, it wasn't part of the service he offered, but, you know, she'll find out the long way after <laughs> speaking to him for fucking hours. I mean, this was happening over the course of a full afternoon. Honestly. <laughs> I was lying in bed and I was crying. Yeah, this I took me a whole fucking. This was like I was trying to do work as well, so it was a pain in the ass because I, I was like, uh, luckily I've got the fr a, a bit of freedom at work to check my phone. But fuck me, he was firing in messages rapid, and I couldn't keep up with I mean, him. I was checking up. I was checking up on this in the in the works canteen. Everybody was giving me sideways looks as to what I was laughing at. So, yeah, someone read over your shoulder where he's like, you my best friend. Oh, yes, bro. Or, or that message to that bird where Mark... Oh. <laughs> we love you long time, hookers. And, the, and everyone's reading over your shoulder. So, I reckon we, we should recommend him. Yeah, go on. You know, him. we've just promoted him. He does, he does offer a genuine service, which I did not yeah. fucking expect, I'll be honest. Right. <clears throat> I would like to know what feedback we're giving him. Uh, what public feedback? Public feedback. This is the written blurb that he will be sharing when people ask him for pictures of what he posts. Because <laughs> I asked him he for posts. pictures of what sort of stuff he posts, and this yeah. is the shit he sent me. He told us he'd get us 2,000 fake followers, and he delivered. So yeah, I want to know from the chat what what am I putting? Just give me. Um, we could do that little word game, you know, where someone says like three words, and the next person says three words, the next person says three words, until we have a full little paragraph. Right, Badger, start. Give us the first three words. I know you're about thirty seconds behind, but Badger, give us our first three words, and someone 
someone can follow up. Just make an orderly queue, guys. Like, to so make an orderly queue. So, obviously, wait till this the next one comes up before you fire on. It, it might do. This isn't gonna work. This so isn't gonna work. It, uh, no. Wait. Go on, prove me wrong. Right. Oh, Orgy started. Orgy started. Cheers, fam. Delivered Cheers, as fam. promised. Cheers, fam. Just promised. Brilliant. <laughs> Delivered as promised. If I had. There'll be more. If I had. Yeah. If I had one shot, one opportunity oh, yeah. to seize everything I ever wanted. <laughs> In this moment, would do you it. capture it or just let it slip? <laughs> just do the whole. Shall I do the whole do verse it. from uh, Lose Your Stuff? Do it. Do it. Oh. Do it. Do the spaghetti version. If I yeah. had all the time. If I had all the time. All the time. <laughs> Come on, three words at a time. This is riveting stuff. And those I mean, we should have probably gone and vote. And those of you that aren't typing, smash that thumbs up button. Smash that thumbs oh, up yeah. button. Mark, could you oh, queue yeah. up some pages for the news? Yes, yes I can. Start it at the top. Yeah, go I, I, I might sign off this uh, feedback from Orgy1968, uh, 1986. <laughs> If I had all the time to love you and reply I'm to you. To. <laughs> to love you and reply to me. Okay. And reply to how can I? No, we need, we need something to, in no, between no, no, those no, two. No, 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 no. The stilted English sounds good. How can I have so, I ending? mean, we had stilted English, so we might as well do it uh, back again. And reply to, uh, full stop, how can I happy ending? And, and leave it there, I think. That, 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 that is pretty good. I think that's good. So, go on, read back, read back what you got. So, so far, I don't think it's long enough, but we've put, so far, no, cheers, no. fam. Delivered as promised. If I had all the time to love you and reply to, how can I happy ending? <laughs> yeah, perfect. <laughs> there you go. Question mark. And then, a, and then, a, then a, no, 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 no. How got a happy ending, exclamation mark, and a, and a thumbs up emoji. There you go. Perfect. Absolutely, yeah. Bob. Oh, what about dear. some hearts or some flowers? Yeah, just 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 stick some some nice kind and, of emoji and a half eaten pe and a half eaten pizza. Yeah, is that, emo is that emoji. an emoji? Yeah. yeah, you can get a half oh, eaten pizza. Oh, or, or what about an eggplant? <laughs> an eggplant. <laughs> <laughs> oh, awesome! Right, amazing. And I then I, 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 I think we should add. Um, Something about him being our best friend. Best friend for life. Best friend. No, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna I'm gonna follow his hashtag example. I'm gonna put hashtag best friend for life, but put spaces yeah. so it only registers yeah. hashtag best. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. Right. I'm gonna also put hashtag taught me everything I knew. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Kaz, have you got some news, mate? I got loads of news, but I'm gonna awesome. blitz through it. Blitz through it. Right, blitz. Go for it. Blitz. All right. So, uh, U.S. lawmaker accused the FDA chief of being too lax about teen vaping. So, in oh, August God. 2017, the FDA announced a major shakeup, as we all know. And uh, following this, many public health and harm reduction advocates were finally able to breathe a sigh of relief. Uh, the agency, on the other hand, had become the recipient of mounting pressures from the other end, and a number of health groups, including the American Academy of Pediatrics, American Cancer Society Cancer Action Network, um, American Heart Association, American Lung Association, and Campaign for Tobacco-Free Kids and Tooth Initiative, even sued. Meanwhile, last month, the U.S. Republic... Can, uh, the U.S. Representative Nita Lowey again, once again, criticised FDA Commissioner Scott Gottlieb for the delay, saying that it was a big, big, whopping mistake, and it helped fuel the alleged rise in teen vaping. So essentially, they are Gottlieb. Split. Where are you? Where are you? Well, he ain't got his job no more, <laughs> is he? So, <laughs> um, and essentially, you've got half the government blaming him for. Um, 
the rise in teen vaping and you've got the entire industry pressuring him from the other side essentially saying you're not doing enough to help us so Gottlieb explained that the agency is trying to keep a balance between making the products inaccessible for youth and keeping them available for adults who want to quit smoking. It's it's a bit of a mess over there, if I'm honest. It's a bit of a mess. Now, the FDA yeah. chief has now left. He has quit his job, and we don't know who's going to be taking over. And that's the scary bit, because they might be worse. Um, you know, devil you know and all that. So... Yeah, that's that bit of news. Um, go next one. Whatever it may be. I can only do one thing at a time. One thing Why, what gonna... are you doing at the other time? I, I, I'm a bit concerned as to what the other thing is that's distracting you. See, hopefully after we update the software, we'll actually be able to screen share again. But at the moment, it just freezes. Okay, so I found this, and basically a new study has said that vaping could save 7 million lives in about 10 years. So I mentioned it a few weeks back about the University of, or New York University, putting out their research on vaping. And this is a bit of a follow-up. So the team set out to measure the real-life impact of endorsing vaping as a smoking cessation aid in comparison to regulating it as just another form of tobacco. Uh, the researchers analysed current and past reports and data related to smoking in order to uncover any relevant patterns and trends. And this indicated that most cigarette smokers had to switch to vape. Oh, if most cigarette smokers had to switch to vaping, an estimated 6.6 .6 million lives would be saved over 10 years, resulting in 86.7 million fewer lives lost due to smoking. Which is crazy. Absolutely crazy. Now, if a company or a product had caused this many deaths, they'd be convicted of war crimes. So how is it that it's only now coming to the point where we're making the, you know, we're making the connection that this is such a good thing? And, you know, if you get more American universities on board, they'll start to follow each other. And once you've got the universities on board, then you can get the government on board because they seem to follow a lot of that research. Um, and then in big writing here, it just says any negative effects of vaping are outweighed by the positive ones. Uh, the team also explained that they only found a potential negative effect of vaping when conducting the most unreasonable simulations and even pointed out that any negative effects that the advent of vaping could have brought about, such as the uptake of vaping amongst youth, are greatly outweighed by positive aspects. In other words, teen vaping isn't a bad thing even though we don't condone it does anyone remember when i was talking about hawaii increasing their smoking age to 100 well now you know you, you know what I, I i read this in our chat uh, in our in our notes as hawaii <laughs> well hawaii. Then the phone company yeah Anyway, sorry, yes. Um, we, we mentioned it a few weeks ago, didn't we, that um, Hawaii were looking at um, increasing smoking age to 100. Yeah, well, However, now, the, yeah, the Hawaii lawmakers have introduced a proposal that would ban menthol cigarettes and flavours in tobacco products, including electronic cigarettes. So, this bill, called SB 1009, would ban tastes or aromas relating to any candy, chocolate, vanilla, honey, fruit, cocoa, coffee, dessert, alcoholic beverage, menthol, milk, mint, wintergreen, herb, or spice. Uh, the aim of the bill is to reduce tobacco-related health disparities and address the youth vaping epidemic. Um, most adult smokers vape flavoured e-liquids, and in line with previous research, a recent large-scale peer-reviewed study published in the harm reduction journal last summer seemed to confirm that restricting e-liquid flavors may discourage smokers from switching to the proven safer alternatives in other words you're taking the incentive and the fun out of the thing that is making this work if we didn't have flavors from the beginning this would not have worked even a fraction of what as well as it has at all agreed uh, absolutely you know i think if, if someone had come along with a product and said, yeah, so you can have your e-cigarette and it's there's nothing to it other than you blow out a bit of vapour, people would be like, oh, it's just like one of them Nicorette inhalers, isn't it? Now, a lot of the things, even the very, very early ones, were mostly one or two flavours. And then obviously very, very quickly flavours started to come around. So I think 
They're gonna kill. They, they. I don't know whether their thing is to kill vaping or just to make it unattractive to kids. But it's it's a tricky one to see where they're going with this. But I think it's a. It, it's, I don't know why Hawaii seems to be doing these big forward movements, and no one else is. I mean, San Francisco have already banned flavors, haven't they? So. Yeah. Talking of unattractive to kids and uh, Hawaii, can I show this meme that I saw earlier that I fucking love? Absolutely love this. Oh. Jason Momo. Incredible. <laughs> <laughs> I, th I thought you were going to go down the Michael Jackson route then. Yeah, I, 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 I realised as I said it, it come across like I was going to go down that Michael Jackson route, but I didn't. Uh, I reckon we've got one uh, time for one more bit of news. Uh, uh, did any of you watch the documentary? I've watched the first half, I haven't watched the second half. Did any of you watch the Oprah interview? No one's seen this. So Oprah did a, a thing called After Neverland, and it was with that Wade and that other dude, whatever his name is, and the producer of the documentary. Now, I love Michael Jackson. I've always loved his music, been a massive, massive fan. I think he's probably the best artist to have ever lived. I watched the documentary, and then I saw some of the feedback from some of Michael Jackson's close, I don't know whether they're friends, producers, security, whatever. And they all supported him and gave a good long list of reasons why these guys were talking bollocks. Then I wa So I believed he was innocent. Then I watched the Oprah documentary, and I am 100% certain he was a paedophile. You see, I, I went in watching, much to Nancy's annoyance, because she adores um, Michael Jackson, always has done, always well do. Um, I went in to watch the documentary with the mindset, he's a paedophile. He is a paedophile. End of. I watched the documentary after the first one I was on the fence on the sec after the second one I don't think he was see that's how I left the documentary but then I watched the Oprah interview and actually what she did was very 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 clever the audience was comprised completely of child abuse victims so they were all adults now but they were all abused as children they were survivors of child abuse and Actually, the the amount the audience agreed with some of their descriptions of the feelings and, and the actions and, and some of the stuff that they said, uh, and there was experts there, there was like leading experts in, in abuse victim support and, and, uh, and all that stuff. And actually, they were describing things that the expert says is exactly indicative of it happening. So you can't fake those thoughts and feelings. You can't. So, from a yeah. psychological standpoint, I am now certain he was a paedophile. I, I wasn't before. I was even after the documentary. I believed that they were just trying to cash in on him. But I genuinely believe, seeing the audience reaction to what they were saying, I just that purely alone was enough to convince me that he did it. Yeah, I need I need to watch this documentary because I just it's on it's I on YouTube. I went in thinking he was a paedophile and then come out thinking that he wasn't. Um, but I need to watch this other documentary. What documentary? Um, yeah. Oprah. No, she's a fucking hater. Chandler. She's a hater apparently. Can't watch that. <laughs> I don't I don't particularly like Oprah, but she does make very, very compelling uh, very, very compelling conversation. Like I watched her interview with Justin Bieber. And I think he's a twat, but the conversation was really, really good. Um, Louis Farou, he tweeted saying, if you've watched that documentary and still believe he didn't do it, you're an idiot. And you're being willfully blind. And I respect Louis Farou's opinion. I, I really do. He's um, genius. He is. So, I don't know. I genuinely think he did it. Yeah. Well... And I, I'd never thought I'd be saying that, as I, I am... A huge Michael Jackson fan of his music, yeah. massively, yeah. massive, massive. I'm, I still am. I can't not like songs because I, I love them. You know what I mean? Like it's like with that little fit shit. I wouldn't listen to them. I wouldn't support them. I wouldn't buy their music, but they have had some really good songs. 
regardless of what they do in their personal life. Do you know what I mean? I'm, I'm against suicide, but I don't hate the prodigy because Keith Flint decided he didn't want to live anymore. Do you know what I mean? It's hard for me to mm. disassociate. Like it, it's easy for me to disassociate the person behind and the music because the music's something completely different. You can hate someone and love something they do. Like a lot of people, they hate Ricky Gervais, but Afterlife, I, I love him personally, uh, and I love Afterlife. Um, and there's a lot of people that hate him that love Afterlife or hate him and love Derek because they disassociate the person with the, with the art. And I think that's that's a lot a lot of people boycotting his music and stuff. It's pointless. He's already dead. He's not making any money. He's not benefiting from anything he's done anymore. His kids haven't done anything wrong. So who gives a shit? Like regardless of music, not uh, not who gives a shit about his child abuse because that's obviously not good. Chandler, <clears throat> you got some Hello? moves lined up for us. No. Ah. Oh. Let's go massive head. I'm going to have to download okay. XSplit now, aren't I? Wait, what, what? Get rid of that. There we go. All right. <laughs> okay. Found on Insta. Apparently, this is the latest vape product available for you to purchase. Incredible. Oh, shit. The height yeah. of innovation, the twist. It's... But it's not TPD compliant. Look at the packaging. Yep, that's wrong. Yeah, it's leak proof. There's no tank on it. It's leak proof. That's the point, actually, oh. because there's no tank. It doesn't need any. Um... Mm -hmm. There's no tank. Why would Why would you? I mean, that you could uh, you could be screwing on a uh, LED battery head on top of that. That could could be anything, couldn't it? <coughs> so, but yeah, no. It, it, I I just went. Hang on, someone's posting. You know, hey, look what we've got as a new product. I'm like, what? Really? Ego twists. There you go. So there we are. Found that one. Awesome. And have you seen this? Is that a side fire? Cthulhu. It's a Cthulhu. It's a Cthulhu two bud. Uh, basically, it's an eighteen three fifty, uh, but it's You're got a MOSFET. It's okay. got a MOSFET yeah. chip at the top. So it looks interesting. I, I thought, you know, I need something to replace my uh, vicious ant that I fucked, and uh, and I think maybe a MOSFET might have uh, might have saved me. Although I'll have just fried the MOSFET instead, but you know. Yeah. Uh, but there you go. So I, I've seen uh, we've seen the Cthulhu. Yeah, I've probably got a few tube mods lying about you can have. And the eighteen three fifty. Send them to me. I've no, got no, 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 no. Petty grow somewhere. Oh, really? Yeah, I don't know where it is though. Dibs, dibs. I, I, I give you, I give you a good price. You love me long time. Indeed. I, well, I do that anyway, Chris. It. I do that anyway, Chris. You know that. Yeah. Uh, right, look, Squid Dude, Squid Dude has released a new juice. I don't think there's a space there, Chandler. What? I think it's Squid Dude. Squid Dude. Squish uh, dude. Hashtag. Hashtag squid dude. Squid dude. Squid dude. Squid dude. Whatever. <laughs> Either way, there you go. I, that, I looks like, that looks like a bottle of juice with an RDA on top. It does actually, doesn't it? It does look, look a little bit like a bottle of juice with an RDA on the top. It but does. there we go. That Ooh, actually that just caught That tentacle's out. creeping me out a bit. How? It, 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 it's like the holes, isn't it? it, it it's like oh, trypophobic. Yeah, I don't, I don't like it. Yeah. Can we? Because I know, I know you don't like the trypophobic mods, do you? No. And, I, and I, I like the design. I like the mod. I hate the design. Yeah, yeah. Uh, um, but I, I actually thought, how on earth did they train that squid to hold a bottle of juice like that? Because <laughs> obviously, I, I, I don't believe anything in Scottish. I cut out then, and I nearly decided not to refresh because uh, until the squid, until the squid's gone. <laughs> Next. Oh. And our favourite friend, look at these. Uh, Nigel Moxon SVB mods has knocked up some more Punisher mods, and I think they are just awesome. Is anyone else what, tired what? of the Punisher logo being on everything though? What would you do? What do you do with, an, with a, 
if you're a teacher and you've got a naughty kid at school, what do you do? Punish them. Beat them. Beat them. Hey, I <laughs> beat them. This is why you don't yeah. work in colleges anymore, Mark. <laughs> beat them. <laughs> But I love the I I I just love the uh, the finishing that he does the the acid etching or whatever it is, uh, the uh, the pattern on it is just awesome. Well, it's called rat. Well, no. It's called rat. It's ratting a mod where you paint it and then you sand layers down. Right. Okay. And then he and are they enameled, enameled, dipped or whatever. Either way, either way, he does them very well and they look very very nice. I don't often post pictures of uh, of fake tricks, and I know. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. There seems to be what? a severe lack of tits tonight. What? I'm saving them. This is far too serious. Saving. Yeah, Why yeah, yeah I'm, no, I'm saving them so far. Seriously, seriously, saving them. Okay, don't worry. So yeah, there you go. Well, I mean, what, what do you think? I, don't you, it, they, that, is it me? Is that um, that is photoshopped? That the colours are put in after. Yes, something? it's photoshopped. Can I just ask, Mark? Do you remember back about twenty fourteen? There was a, a picture someone photoshopped of, of like a vape trick, and they put they had some sort of rainbow liquid, and people bought that liquid, then complained because it, their color, their clouds are the same yeah. color. Oh, For <laughs> fuck's that. sake. And someone released uh. a mod that had a coloured light on it, so when you blew your clouds, you could shine the coloured light through it. Yeah. You can essentially do that with just an LED and put it in the positive and negative terminals. Yeah, I know, but... I, I know there, was a, there was a lot of videos, weren't there, where you've got coloured LEDs shining up and they did the tricks over the top of these lights and it, and, and it changed colour as it moved across the room. Um, but yeah, I just, thought, I just thought that looked quite cool. And I don't know whether the ring has been imposed afterwards, but uh, if it hasn't, that's really cool. Okay, what do you guys think to this one? Oh dear. Are they I know, unicorns? That's... Are they unicorns with tits? I think they're my they ponies. Are... There you go. I told you they were coming. So, yeah. What's with the... Slightly, slightly sexualized uh, My Little Ponies on juice bowls. My I was a little... My daughter would be devastated. My daughter I know. would be devastated. I know. If I had that juice range, I would have to hide the bottles because it would, it would, it would, it would, it would create, it would create tears. I mean, it, it's like it's like finding out that um, Miley Cyrus isn't completely as, as uh, what innocent. I, what I want to know. Years, what I want to know is what that pile of grass is doing behind it. Like that, they know that <laughs> unicorns eat a specific food. They don't There's exist. Like a sort of ratty sofa in the background. Yeah. And, yeah, but the, yeah, why is there a pile of random grass in the background? It's it's like what? So, oh, now then, have you seen That's... Tippy Muds? Tippy Muds, who who had had stopped, it, it stopped making, uh, it stopped making mods. It stopped. He's back. Is he the same guy that makes Tippy Cups? Tippy, yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's the one. Yeah, well done, Kaz. <laughs> So, <laughs> I'm sorry, that was terrible. That's all right, but I mean, he's he's come back with a corker. I mean, it's got a DNA board in it, um, beautiful block, and it's a twenty, yeah, eighteen six fifty, twenty seven hundred, twenty one seven hundred, depending which whether you've got sleeves or whatever. You, but uh, but yeah, so it's not a squonker. It looks like a squonker from this position. It's not a it's not a squonker. No, it's got it's got a back battery. It's in a battery tube at the back, and the oh, battery okay. tube is. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, okay. Do you know I, I've given all these I've given all these pictures names so I know what they are when I'm coming up, and I now can't remember what this one is. It says switch. Oh yeah, I remember. Yeah, I've seen that. That's cool. I'm like, what? Okay, it's not vape related in the slightest. But I saw that and and thought, oh, some clever shit's put a uh, put a switch in in a doll's house, um, and then it then it registered that no, they've just made a, they've just made giant uh, control that's, that's pads. That's a sixty inch TV, just to give you an idea of the size. That's a sixty inch TV, yeah. and they've made that switch out of basically plywood. 
Yeah, they've just made uh, made the control pads and and attached them to the, each side of the uh, TV, and it just looks exactly like a switch. It, it amused me when I saw it. Oh dear. Right. Uh, this Badger next... apparently knows Badger apparently knows the person that owns the abused unicorn line. Really? Yeah, apparently so. Jamie, apparently. Okay. There we go. Next. Right, next one. Okay, I, you, you've got to prepare yourself for this. I saw this, right? Okay, and it's it, it's a coil shot, so we're still... It's, it's a coil shot, um, but it's not the coil that caught my attention. I have never seen wick that is as well-groomed as that. Oh. How do you... How the, that 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 uh, that that wick looks like it's it's been to the hairdressers. It's just like. Does it, it mean? Kind of looks like your hair, the top yeah. half. Yeah, kind of going a bit. Yeah, mine mine's not quite as white as that, but I'm working on it. So, and I've just found my next tank. Are you ready? Mm-hmm. Ready. God. What the hell? I want that tank! I have no idea. I think there might be a mod that is squashed underneath it, but I, I'm not sure. You can fit your head but... inside that. <laughs> is that just me, or well, is that a Cloud Chasers Ink logo? That uh, is a Cloud Chasers Ink logo. It is looks it? looks like it, but I think... I think Crash, Chris crashed as he said that, but yeah, completely agree. It does look like a cloud chaser. It's like when they made that giant three-foot smock X priv, and everyone was like, "Oh, it's not real because the uh, the the five tens in the middle, and on the real thing, it's on the right." Okay, Mark, you yeah. seriously need to make a completely new uh, show channel because this is fucking ridiculous. The amount of times this kicks me off. <laughs> It's only on this fucking thing as well. It's on nothing else. You're not you're not having fun there, Chris, are you? It's winding me up. I've Sorry. had to refresh about fifty times. Come on, Charlie. Right, and you're new loops. And just to finish off. There we go. I Where thought is she coming look, out of. Look, I, I, the reason I've went for, I went for this one is because it's just because. She's not gone for the traditional uh, pose. It's it's just here you go. It's something new. So she's upside down. Here you go. This is me giving birth to myself. There you go. <laughs> so it just just look, caught my eye. If you look, the two black bits either side look like legs, and it looks like someone shitting her out as a giant baby head. <laughs> <laughs> I think those are actually her legs. So anyway, go back a sec, Mark. Vapors girl. Following upside down, is that where she was when she took? Because that's that's where your location normally sits. Her location is upside down. Maybe Apparently, she's a fan but yeah, of, like, where are you? Stranger she's upside things. down. So, I suppose I could have turned it. Can I rotate that picture? I don't think I can. Oh well. Never well, mind. you got to give her kudos for getting the tag <laughs> vapors girl. You should you should yeah. re you should rotate that completely. It just look like. <laughs> you know when he comes back he is going to have a hissy fit who is Chris have you seen oh, yeah. <sighs> I've just looked up her profile I don't know if you can see this have you seen what her name is Jennifer focuses. no that's not going to focus is it no how's that is that any her better that, that is her freaky her name is Cass all strange Sorry. people. Oh, yeah, are. That, that is a bit weird. That is, is a little bit strange, though, isn't it? Anyway, there you go. Sorry, carry on. Oh, I smashed my fucking computer in. <laughs> Tonight, it's been emotional. Thanks. It's been emotional just as he crashes. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you 50 quid, 
I was going to say, I bet he doesn't come back. I, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> Chris, oh. quick. It's been emotional. Quick, do yeah, it. Thanks. Bye. Hey, hey.